What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Sergeant Moby here, and today I'm bringing you another episode of Far Harbor, the Fallout 4 DLC, and I just came over here, and there's a Myluk being boiled, I'm pretty sure he's being boiled alive, you can see there his, uh, his, his talons have been, his pincers have been bound, he's not having a very good time, he's completely tied up in there, that guy's fucked. Can we turn it up? No, we can't turn it up. Okay. So, if we have a look on our trusty pit boy here, you can see Walk in the Park is our active quest. We have to go to talk to Old Longfellow. So, let's go do that right now. He's in the last plank pub, right next to the Myluck. So, I'm assuming the Myluck is, uh, is Barsnix or uh, something along those very, very morbid and I'm assuming tasty lines. But uh, I'm not sure. Now, once again, my mouse just fell off the, uh, the mouse pad. Let's just put that back. Okay. So, once again, we are here. I say once again because I've already done this record. And it didn't go very well the first time. The wrong mic was selected. Silly movie. Right. So, this guy. Mm-hmm. You do that, Mitch. Enjoy it. Just uh, take this Islanders Almanac real quick. Unlocked POI map markers across the island. Lovely. Captain Avery said you can get me to Acadia. Heard there was a scuffle out there. You get your hands dirty with the... I'm yes, I did. Leading people to their deaths in the park. Last fell, I couldn't keep up. In the last five minutes. Well, can you okay. tell me about Acadia? Strange folk right there. Call themselves synths. Seems to me synthetic they people. Be left alone to live their life in peace. They've done some good things for us islanders. The fog condensers, most especially, wouldn't even be a far harbor left. Mm-hmm, I'm sure. Okay. So I have some parents are worried about their runaway daughter. She went to Acadia and I need to find her. Someone's headed for Acadia. We'll see what's going on here. Yours worth dying over, huh? Yeah, every well I'm I'm you should give it down. All her family has. <laughs> You'd have to be a real wretch not to give it down. Bah. This goes yeah. against all reason. But I could get you to Acadia. But you've got to listen to me. Go where I say, when I say. Mm -hmm. Still won't be gotcha. easy. You stock up on your necessities, Brad X and the like. None gotcha. Real work can begin. Come on, let's go. Let's go, Longfellow. Follow me. Old Longfellow. So we are going to meet him outside of the last plank pub, which apparently is uh, is full of pissheads. And even the bartender, he was uh, he was slurring his words. Let's hope he doesn't ride any Brahmin tonight. Maybe he'll uh, he'll get pulled over by the fun police, or you know, shot by gunners or trappers. Sorry, I'm on an island and I'm talking, still talking like I'm a mainlander. So I'm going to get that out of my out of my system. Okay. Let's go. Maradok Jerky. You can actually go over to these fog condensers and grab the condensed fog. Not sure what it does. I'm sure I'll find out in due course. Let's grab those. Okay, so I got a feeling there's gonna be. Hello, Oboe. 
Don't stand up. I want to shoot you in the face. Dang it. Fine. Shoot you in the face instead. Okay, well apparently I can't shoot that guy. I can shoot this guy. And there goes his head. Let's see if I can... There you go. Fresh lobster. I don't think it's going to be very fresh anymore. Yep, playing hide and seek with trappers. That's the way. Look, uh, looks like Willie got mad. Yeah, what fisherman is that? What was he using? He was using a. Is this guy? No, that wasn't the guy that was using the gun. There was a gun somewhere. There we go. Here he is. It's over here. Oh, wait. Relentless aluminium baseball bat. It's pretty sweet. And a meat hook. It's gonna be fun. Do that. Right. Also in here. Sometimes I do uh, the uh, the dumb thing and start grabbing uh, grabbing items before before the battle's even finished. So I kind of need to stop doing that while I'm doing these. During my regular playthroughs, though, I can uh, can do whatever I like. So how's everyone doing? You having a good time? You uh, you enjoying the Fallout 4? I'm sure some of you are uh, are excited as I am when I, when I first heard about this. I uh, I didn't quite shit my pants, but I've been enjoying Fallout 4 for for ages. Um, it's a masterpiece. Would you knob off? I'm trying to speak. Thank you. Yeah, I, I love I love this game. I love everything about this game. It's some of the things are kind of counterintuitive in the way that you do certain things like with the build menus and whatnot. But for the most part, having a having a pretty decent time. Nope, long fellow's on his way again. Let's see. Right away. Almost broke into any other. Hey there puppy. Hello. Bye bye. Oh god. Yep, quickly reload that. Shoot him. Shoot him. Oh, talking about kicking a dog while he's down. Ooch. Right on the pooch. Yep, I'm sure we do. At some point, I am gonna. Maybe I'll pop my Radex now, actually. Just get that over with. Okay, so I can resist a hundred rads, which is lovely because at the moment I'm not. Uh, oh god. Okay. I'm gonna carry on with uh, with old Longfellow. I wonder if that's his actual first name. Old last name. Long oh, that's rad. That's radiation right there. This, if it wasn't for all the fog, this would actually kind of look like a lovely place to go on a picnic or something. Now this is kind of interesting because the gulpers will actually try and kill the myolurks. Hey! So rude. Okay. So rude. 
grab all the meat we can. Back to Longfellow. Come on, buddy. Let's get him on going. Not really. They can grow two, three times the size of a man. Good thing we don't see too many of them. Uh oh. Bunk. Bullet time. I feel like I'm in a John Woo movie. John Woo movie. Hey. Stop it. Pre war money. To go in my bathtub of pre war money. If you don't have a pre bathtub of pre war money, you're doing it wrong, man. It's also kind of good for cloth, so I recommend picking up any pre war money you see. No wonder this place is a shit tip. Have you seen how much nuclear waste there is around here? Jesus Christ, Fenton. Hello, crazy person. Bringing one more soul to the damnation, old man. Yep, absolutely. What have we here? Another rad worshiping lunatic. That's what. Your gods do not harm me. I am shielded by my faith. <coughs> Let me say. Faith Kiss me. Against those two? <laughs> Calm down. Just settle down, okay? You're right. Waste of ammo. Do not sully this one with your blasphemy, old man. Shut up. I suggest you go. I'm bored of talking to you now. Yeah, whatever you say. Watch your crazy lady. You walk through Adam's kingdom now. If you're done wasting. Absolutely. I say we forget these people. Okay. So got some interesting stuff. It's a big observatory. Didn't notice that before. Okay. Break on through to the other side, yeah? Alrighty. Excellent. Katie has already been watching us for a good spell. If you want to talk with him, just go inside. Thank you, I will. You need my help again. You come see me. Got a cabin just outside of Far Harbor. Good place to tool up your gear. Get some rest. Or get stupid drunk. Alcoholics. Sure Alcoholics everywhere. Something strong. There's enough to share. Maybe later. All right. But I'm serious about the offer. You ever want to hunt the forests and waters of the island? Okay. I can think of worse things to do. I'm sure you could. Okay. Bye bye. Okay. So let's have a look around here. So we're completely walking the park. 496 experience for that. Let's have a look. another look around, see if we're missing anything. Anything up here? So this is the radio that the chick we're looking for, who I can't actually remember her name right now. Um, yeah, this is uh, the place that we were she was probably talking to him on top of that little uh, radio place there. So let's have a look down here, we've got some cement. And I think I saw some fertilizer there. There we go. Okay. Let's see if there's any anything interesting in here. Still packs. And a uh, flower pot. Fun times. Blood leaf. Okay, so around here you can get some, uh, get quite a lot of ingredients. There's a lot of mast around here as well. So we're going to go into Arcadia now and see what we can see. So how's everyone doing? Hope you enjoyed the last video. 
This is obviously a continuation of Far Harbor. Um, yeah, I hope you did enjoy the last video. Video. Remember, we've still got a skill point that we need to spend. Still waiting on suggestions from you guys, what you want me to do with it. So, I mean, nothing is off limits, guys. Absolutely nothing. Tell me what you want. You gotta let me know. Otherwise, I'll just spend it. Kasumi, that was her name. Kasumi. Really, I am impressed. Few would brave the kind of journey you had for the sake of someone else. Kasumi is here. She's safe and unharmed, and you're free to see her if you'd like. Before you do, though, yeah. tell me, do you think Kasumi is a saint? We're not answering any more questions until you play straight with us. You tell him, Nick. Who the hell are you, really? There's only one Shint with that kind of face and a mind of his own. And I only see him when I look in a mirror. Nick. It... It can't be you. Don't give me that. Sure it can. You're trying to pull. I've never seen you before in my life. Please, if you're willing to give me a chance, I can explain. Mm -hmm. Is this a joke? Do you really know, Nick? Let me tell you what I know, and you can judge for yourself. We were prototypes, Nick. The first synths capable of independent thinking and judgment. Keep talking. One of the Institute's experiments had to do with how our brains could process personality. If we could handle individualized feelings and behaviors, I was allowed to develop mine based on experience. But with you, they wanted to try transferring an entire personality into you. It well, they failed. Several attempts before the personality imprint worked. I saw you wake up not knowing who or what you were so many times. I couldn't let them do it to you anymore. We were the only two prototypes they made. I literally saw myself in you. You were my well, that's weird. brother, Nick. I helped you escape. Incentius. Incentius. If I were your brother, I'd remember. That's yeah. where you'd be wrong. This happened over a century ago. There's there's only so much memory that can fit into the prototype brains we have. <laughs> I've heard enough. I think you and I need to talk about this. Maybe not now, though. No. We need to get back to why we're here. Focus on the consuming at the moment. I don't need you to believe me. I'm just glad to see you again. Whenever you're ready, I'll be here. Now. About young Kasumi, <coughs> it's important that you understand exactly why she's here. I asked you before if you think she's really a sin. If you could indulge me with an answer. Yes, Dima, I think she's a sin. Because why else would her mother hesitate when she said, I gave birth to her? Well, and her father always wanted to keep her out of danger. She's a sin. She's a sin. Why she left home. Kasumi had honest questions about herself. She came here for answers. None of us take this transition lightly. She's facing the possibility of her entire life being a lie. Mm -hmm. That someone stripped her very identity from her and made her into something she isn't. I want you to understand that before you see her. She has a chance here to live as a synth, not hiding, not pretending to be something else. One more question, if you'll indulge me. <coughs> You're here for Kasumi, but 
I suspect there could be another reason you came to us. Tell me, are you a synth? Am I a synth? Um, it's a very good question. How would one know? I even know? I'm afraid if you're looking for some biological test we can do, there isn't any. None that aren't fatal. In yeah, I don't do those. You have to look for the signs, holes in someone's memory, feelings of unexplained isolation, odd dreams, but ultimately, Mm. You have to decide for yourself. What do you believe? Have you ever questioned your humanity? Sarcastic. But if I squint real hard in the mirror, sometimes I look like someone else. <laughs> I'm afraid when I try that trick, nothing really changes. I know it yes. might seem impossible that you could be a simp, but tell me. What's the first thing you can remember? I remember being in my house the day the bombs fell. We ran to the vault. We were frozen. I was the only survivor. No memories hmm. before then? Just a single day and then waking up alone? We so easily accept what's presented to us as the truth. Don't but he had a backstory. Isn't it funny how I have a backstory. Feel like a whole different reality. I'm not a sin. You're a sin. Places. He knows he's a sin. Sounds and Shit. colors can change, or someone else has changed them. I won't lie um. to you. There will always be other explanations. Trauma, disease, the background radiation. They all take their toll on the mind. Mm -hmm. But I can promise you that we will accept you, no matter what you decide you are. Well, that's Thank that's you. lovely. You've given me a lot to think about. I'm glad to hear it. Acadia is open to you. Feel free to walk the grounds. Introduce yourself to my co-founders, Faraday and Chase. And right now, sure I'm just going to gonna go talk to the scenery. She's usually working down below. Is there anything else you need from me? Not right now. I should get going. Of course. Bye bye. There a long time. Are you feeling all right? Uh, oh god, hello. Bye bye. Okay. So that was obviously Faraday over the intercom and Chase, who was the chick in the horse outfit. So we're gonna, gonna jump through this hole right here and say hello to Kasumi. Obviously, I knew that hole was there. I knew I could get down through that hole. Kasumi Nakano. Sorry, I might interrupt something. What's that you're working on? Just trying to cobble some pre-war junk into something useful. Now, oh you really? Telling me what you're doing here? Your parents sent me. They want you to come home. They... they did what? You came all this way for me. That's so, right. Mom and Dad... Uh, I mean, those people that were taking care of me, they wouldn't want me back. Not if they knew the truth. Because you're not really <clears throat> their daughter. You're a sin. Yeah. We'd seen the Institute work on uh, I thought if I just child technology. That have gone in. I Hi, Mom, Dad. I'm a sin. Bye. Your real daughter is dead, and I replaced her? Kasumi, I think you're just confused. Everyone has doubts about who they are sometimes. It's part of life. I, I really and charisma wins wondering. again. If I wasn't a sin, things would be so much simpler. Acadia isn't what I thought it was. There's more going on here than just the refuge. But I can't leave until I've gotten to the bottom of it. I've been running long enough. If something's going on, then I can help. Alrighty. Just tell me what's happening. I don't know how you could. Wait. Wait, of course you can help. You find things, track down answers. That's what you do, right? That's why you came after me. That and a big pile of money. 
a big secret here on this island. There's something way more important than just one lost girl. All right. Uh, okay. Okay. Where to begin? You saw all those computers that Dimas hooked up to, right? Mm -hmm. They hold his memories or offload data from his brain. Or maybe some combination of both? Well, Faraday asked me to help do some repairs on them. And, you know, I got curious. There's like a century's worth of life experiences in there. And that's when I see it. The data models Dima has been making. One mm. was the fog taking over Far Harbor. Another was a nuclear detonation on the island. Plus, death counts. What if Reminds me of war games. So open and welcoming because he's actually hiding something from us. A plan to wipe out the rest of the island. Let's do I'll this. I can. But that's not much to go on. I know. I've been working on that, but I haven't had But it's luck. something. I keep seeing Dima, Faraday, and Chase head into the laboratory at the other end of the hall. Then they come out later looking like they've been arguing. There's actually a storage space right next to there. It'd be a perfect spot to hide an eavesdrop. But it's been locked up. I've not also a problem. been breaking into Faraday's terminal, since he and Dima are so close, but security on it is crazy eavesdropping on the next meeting sounds like our best bet I'll see if I can find a way inside that room okay do this good luck and come back as soon as you found anything okay let's go do this so the door we want is right down here right down the other end got an expert lock Which a simpleton could pick. Lovely. Let's see if there's anything up in here. Real quick. Hello, runaway. Fertilizer. Excellent. One step closer to become becoming the water white of the wasteland. Or maybe I'm more of a Jesse Pink. I don't know. Leave in the comments what you think. Am I more Walter White? Or am I more uh, Jesse Bitch Pinkman? So let's see what's going on here. We need to accomplish this without bloodshed. Far Harbor and the Children of Adam have a right to exist on this island. The same as us. They're going to kill each other, Dima. There's no stopping it. We need to pick a side now. Haven't we already picked a side? Building the fog condensers around Far Harbor wasn't exactly a neutral act. We couldn't stand by and let the people of this island die to the fog. Just like you couldn't just leave the Cult of Adam without a home? Giving them the submarine base was a mistake. I agree. The nucleus, as they're calling it, is basically one big fortified position. Far Harbor had cast them out. They have strange beliefs, but they have always accepted us for what we are. And Confessor Martin was a friend. Well, the new Confessor yes, is dead. High Confessor Tectus is an unstable megalomaniac, and he's going to keep threatening us as long as we're helping Far Harbor. Guys, can we talk about the elephant in the room? We keep dancing around it. My old memory banks in the submarine base. I can't believe you never told me about those. I have to wait until they become a security risk. I know how it looks in hindsight. But at the time, it was an act of trust. I was honestly more worried they'd accidentally trip the pre-war security and get hurt. Giving the children my old home. Allowing them to safeguard my old memories. I thought our people would be working together. Just how secure are the banks? How long do we have? And what's in them? I've gone over this before, Chase. I don't know what's in them. That's how it works. It's as close to forgetting something as I have. But maybe he forgot something. Projections of worst case bad. scenarios. If we do nothing and the wrong knowledge falls in the wrong hands. So send me over there. I'll be in and out in a day. We can't risk it. They know you're from Acadia. If you're caught, or even seen, 
then it's war. We should at least prepare her to go in. We're running out of options. I say we tell her how to crack into the memory banks. You've been working on this without me? It yep. came up in a private moment, Chase. But yes, we've been writing a program that will let you access and download my memories. It's not going to be like a normal hack. You'll be breaking through a version of my own mental network. It'll consider you to be an intruder. I've loaded the program with some instructions I've recorded that will help guide you through it. I'm afraid it's difficult to explain without seeing it for yourself. I'm finishing up some tweaks to the program right now. I'll leave a copy of it for you on my desk when I'm done. Get the program, use it okay. to break into the memory banks. Got it. Hopefully you won't have to. We'll keep monitoring the situation. I only want you going in if we have no other choice. Well, you do have another choice, and that choice is me, buddy. And I would be pretty happy to go into, uh... Go into that area. Fuck some shit up. Hey, look at all this pretty, pretty ammo. Sweet, didn't notice this when I came in. And update, and... I think that's everything at the moment. That was a pretty decent storage room. Thank you, Sense, for leaving stuff lying around all over the place. Muchly appreciated. Okay, so let's see what Kasumi... Oh, Kasumi's not here anymore. Let's go upstairs, talk to Dima. No, let's go upstairs. Grab the program. Kill Phil. Um, have a nice cold pint and wait for all this to blow over. Uh, I don't think that will work somehow, but uh, we've got to try. Let's go up here. And talk to Nope. Keep forgetting. Gotta grab this one. There it is, program. And talk to Dima. Okay. So this episode is probably gonna be around. Uh, probably around the 40 minute mark and we're gonna get to the nucleus and then you lovely people are gonna have to wait I'm afraid for the next exciting installment of uh, Sergeant Movies let's play through Far Harbor I suppose you have maybe this is an opportunity for both of us I can't send any of my people without risking the children of Adam linking them back to Acadia but you, you're new to the island. Dima's so soft-spoken, it's actually kind of... It's actually getting to me. It's kind of annoying. All right. I'm listening. Before I begin, how much do you... Sure. I know all I need to. Then my plan is simple. Pose okay. as a recruit. So... Infiltrate the children of Adam. Gain access to their base in the old command center. Should be pretty easy to do. Security measures. You'll find my memory banks. I'll give you the program you need in order to access my memories. Bring me anything you find. It's not going to be like a normal hack. You'll be breaking through a version of my own mental network. It'll consider you to be an intruder. I loaded the program with some instructions I've recorded that will help guide you through it. I'm afraid it's difficult to explain without seeing it for yourself. I'm sure it is. Actually, I've already got it. I already had the program. I was thorough. Well, I guess that just means I've picked the right person for the job. One more thing before you leave. Whatever you do, don't assault the children of Adam directly. Aww. Their ultimate goal must be to bring peace. If you attack them, They'll consider themselves at war with the outside world. If we what if I consider myself at war with them? Of yours will be back. Count on it. 
Come on, Nick. Let's not waste the man's time any longer. Alright. Open up the island. And we'll be well on our way to the nucleus or the submarine bays. Yes, that's a brilliant idea, isn't it? Give religious fanatics access to nuclear weapons silos. You're an idiot, Dima. An absolute idiot. Okay, which way are we go? Gonna change this. No, I actually have. Gosh darn it. go back to Kasumi and then we are going to the nuclear missile pens or the uh, submarine pens even so down here nope not down here down here why do we that's really weird it, um spawned us like Six feet in front, of, in, inside the building. Okay, so we'll take our little jumpy hole. Hadouken, come on. Turns out, Kasumi. Dima's earliest memories are in the hands of the children of Adam. He's afraid of what they're going to find. So, is that what these death projections were about? It wasn't Dima planning to destroy the island. He's worried the children of Adam were. in those memories that he would leave them behind. Is there really something in them that's dangerous? Do Probably a torture childhood. Into his memories? Assuming you can get past the children of Adam, of course. I got this program that Faraday and Dima wrote. It's supposed to help me access the memory banks. Really? Alrighty. How would that work? When I was taking a peek in the computers he has here, Dima was hooked up to his chair. I was just tapping into it. I wonder if you'll need to, you know, connect to the old banks the way he does? Some kind of connection between your head and the computer. Oh, I thought Anya could sense then could do that. Sam would be translating Dima's thoughts and data, uh -oh. helping you through any security guarding it. I'm sorry, I'm making assumptions. It's just, well, it's a little exciting, isn't it? You'll let me know what you find? I'll keep an eye on things here. Alrighty. I'll get Dima's memories, and then we'll figure things out from there. Good luck. Thank you, Kasumi. Thank you for the caps. They will be much to be appreciated. Alright. Nope. Rush down. Okay, so here's the stairs. Best left, forgotten. Gain access to Dima's... Dima's terminal. 500 caps, and Nick liked what I did. Oh, Nick, you flatter me so. So. Now we can get on our way to the missile sub submarine pen things. You know what? I think we're going to have a good time. I think we're going to see some interesting stuff. I think we're going to probably see someone die. And maybe we'll see... And there's some radiation in Far Harbor. In Far Harbor? Radiation? No. That's crazy. Yeah. About as crazy as Donald Trump potentially becoming president. But that might happen. Hope you're proud of yourselves. Right. Back into the fog. Strap on some. Uh, not more like me. What does this do? Okay, we need to find. Not buff out. Radix. That'll help us get through here real quick. Jangles, the moon monkey. Take all his stuff.
I love Jangles. He's also creepy as hell, but you know, he's a good dude. Is Senor Jangles? Okay, this isn't gonna work. Let's see if I can remember actually. Yeah. So we go this way. Cut through some more fog. Uh, aha. The possibility of a route up the mountain? I think so. Get back on track and go the actual way we're supposed to be going. Alright, let's carry on. Okay, well, I don't want to fall down that. Let's go down this side. What? Oh god. A terrible, terrible idea. Okay. So we're getting ever closer to where we need to be. Back into the fog. This has been surprisingly uneventful, this trip. Thought at least we would see something to kill. So we need to be over there. Oh, heavily irradiated water. Okay, you know what? Let's do this. 95 rounds a second is not too bad. We can make it, we can make it, we can make it. Alrighty. So back to the regular ride count. And here we are, at the Nucleus. Richter, please, you can't do this. We've been it's loyal- It's Grand Zealot to you, and your dedication has come to doubt. You need to prove your faith. One of you may return to the fold. The other will return to Adam. Richter, this is insane. You can't expect us to- Kaboom. Will there be anything else? That'll be all, sister. Thank you, Granzel. Crazy, crazy bastards. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to leave this one here. We're going to explore the uh, submarine pens in the next episode. I've been Sergeant Moby. Remember, I have a skill point that I need, still need to spend. I'm almost at another skill point, so maybe, maybe we have two to spend. Maybe not. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. But I want to thank you all very much for watching. I hope you have a brilliant, brilliant day. And I shall catch you all next time. Sergeant Moby, signing off.